Hi, it's Deborah from Beacon of Light, and today is Saturday, September 28th. Happy weekend to all of you, and happy Catter Day to all of you as well. Wow, three cards just fell out. All right, thanks again for all the um, likes and comments. I do appreciate it. All right, here's our three cards for today. We've got the Four of Wands, Freedom. The Queen of Wands in reverse, that's creativity. And then we've got the Wheel of Fortune, Angel of Destiny in reverse. We are entering a time of walking through an opening, a portal. This Four of Wands is a portal. It is an opening. It is a celebration. It is time for owning, owning, um, self-ownership, uh, freedom. Freedom in this situation is like freedom to be creative, freedom to follow your own destiny. You are the creator of your own destiny. And come on up, Thelma. Come say hi. Come on. Thelma's in the room. Come on up, kitty. Come on. Um, so it, this, this four of wands, this opening, this portal, this um, invitation is what I'm calling it. It's an invitation to open yourself up a little bit more to your, your creative, uh, your create your creativity and open yourself up to what you could possibly do. And so this wheel of fortune and the, this queen of wands, they're in reverse because it's like, you have the power, you have the freedom for your own opportunities, for your own creativity. And when you do something new, when you take the invitation that's being handed to you to go do something new, the possibilities are endless. You can do whatever you want. Come on up here. I know you want to come up here. Hold on. Thelma wants me to pick her up. Come up, say hi. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Here we go. Here's your baby. There's Thelma. Now Thelma says hi to everybody. So there's unlimited possibilities when you are willing to when you're willing to take that invitation that's being offered to you, it says freedom. It's like, it's your own desires. It's what you want to do and you have the power to create it. So it's freeing you from any type of limited thinking or belief systems. But I really feel that this, so this, um, solar eclipse that's coming in on October 2nd, it's inviting us to truly step out uh, as being an individual and realize that we are all one and we need each other to, to help us on this creative path. We need to be in, in the relationship because it, Libra is about relationship and this solar eclipse is in Libra. This relationship that we have with ourselves is also in relationship to other people, to source, to God, to spirit, whatever it is that you believe in. And this step that's being taken, this invitation that's being given right now is the opportunity to see all potential in everyone and how you can assist each other on your own creative destiny. And it's so much needed right now because there's so much division in the world and having that un union or that, that relationship in balance between one another is so important but we are being asked to open ourselves up to seeing everyone and everything as one. So this invitation will project, will propel you forward to multiple opportunities when you can see it from a different perspective through the invitation of an opening that maybe you didn't realize was there but it's going to allow you to be more creative and allow others to bond with you on your creative path. Even pushing your destiny further than you ever thought it could ever be pushed. That's what I'm feeling. Um, hope this makes sense. I know it makes sense to me. 
and uh, Thelma too. <laughs> All right. Have a great Saturday. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Take care. Bye.